Hey you, hey, yeah you, watching this video. I know I cut off the video and you're like, oh CK, what else do you possibly have to tell us? Well, what I'm here to tell you guys is it's finally out. We dropped three, three new designs on the merch store, the brand new revamped merch store. It looks like this. We have new merch that dropped today just in time for the playoffs this Sunday. We have the new big 15 design with the ck2k metro on the front and that's not all because guess what we can say playoffs now baby and get your verse that make sure to let you guys know because all year we've been so afraid of using the p word at least i've been afraid of using the p word but i had some of you guys that were with me on that but now we can say the playoffs and that merch is on the store as well make sure you go pick all of that up and the brand new design for the real ones the people who are supporting your boy all the way through you guys know the model of the channel and that is let's get it we got the new let's get it merch there as well that's for the ones that want to support the channel support your boy so those are the prices and everything on there and that's it no, it's not. Everything starting today is 20% off until Monday. And if we win game one of the playoffs, it will be extended for another week. But for right now, over 20% off on all merchandise right now over on the CK store if you put in the code P word. I, I just made the most sense. It just made the most sense. But yes, use code P word and you get 20% off on all merchandise in the store. My CK crew members. I got some for you guys, so stay tuned to that. So get your merch today, guys. I appreciate all you guys. And also, we have the old designs, the Mitchell Robinson Skyline design. We got the CK Crew design for those who want to represent and let people know that you've been here from the jump. All of the other designs up there, too. The New York Knox is there, but it's not going to be up for very long. So go today, all right? CK Store, CK Merch. Mine's already on the way. I, mine's coming in the mail as we speak, okay? Get yours today. Join the CK Crew membership to find out what other things you guys can get over there. All right, back to your video. What's going on, CK Crew? Boy, CK Two here, and welcome back to another video, guys. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell. Do not forget to like this video. We got a fun one for you guys today. Make sure you go follow the Twitch channel. I am CK. Link is in the description below. Join the Discord. You know all those fun things. But today we got a fun video, and I'm looking for it. I always enjoy doing these videos. Now I've seen the comments for the last few months, and it's been a long time since we've done a video like this, and you guys really enjoy these videos. Like I. A lot of people who are like myself that like to um to dabble in the arts of reddit and i'm so excited to go on next reddit right now as we are on this whole week break until our next next game which is on sunday which is gonna be game one against the hawks i, I can only imagine what all the knicks fans are doing with their free time the memes the tweets the trash talk is going to be perfect so i thought the perfect time to jump into a reddit video would be today oh man all right this is how we're starting this is how we're going to start. Yeah, I, I saw this yesterday. I saw that Merida Blasio. Is there context in this? Uh, Merida Blasio's daily. Co oh, so he's been doing COVID briefings in New York. Oh, my gosh. This this is. Mayor de Blasio is giving an update on the coronavirus pandemic in New York City. Uh -huh. Let's go to it. whole NBA, to their great credit, are. Not a fan of it. Look at the likes to this. Look, and I'm going to add on. This man will shut down. I told y'all, y'all on Reddit are so weird. Get this picture of Frank Nilekina without his shirt on off of my screen. Not even a Frank stand, but I 100,000% rather play him over Alfred Payton to guard Trey in the series. I think that's just a common belief by everybody. I said that in my um my preview video uh, about the series. I'm gonna upload this real quick. 69. The perfection of this right now, this image that's on my screen right now is hilarious. It's a shirtless picture of Frank for all of those, you know, Frank stands. But then on top of that, 69 lot. <laughs> but what was I saying? I was saying that, yes, to me, it just makes the most sense if that Frank Nielakina gets burned in this series. I feel like he is going to be such a helpful piece. The way he ended off the season uh, with the last few games, he played really good basketball. And let's not forget the kid was shooting, what, 46% from the three-point line? And yes, he wasn't getting those minutes, but when he does play, he still makes the th it makes, still makes his shot. That's what's important to me. So I think it makes the most sense that you put Frank Nielakina out there. Will it happen? 
we'll see. I, I doubt he starts, but we'll, we'll, we'll see what happens. All I ask, all I ask uh, Tom Thibodeau is you just give him as many minutes as you give Alfred Payton. You give Alfred Payton 12 minutes, give Frank 12 minutes. That's all I'm saying. NBA 2021 season wins above below the preseason Vegas win total. Oh, I love seeing this. I love seeing this. Look at this. Remember what they said about us in Vegas. They said we were supposed to win what? 20, 20, 21 games? I, I already forgot. I ain't gonna lie to you. At first, I was looking for the Knicks. I'm like, where are they in this mix? They had to be at the top. They all the way up here. 186%. Again, I have to shout out anybody that took that bet. I wish I did because I would still have been right because I'd said that I thought we were going to win more games than what Vegas had to say. So I still would have won some money. But damn, 41 wins. There's a lot of people that, that made money off of Vegas this year. And shout out to all of you guys. Look at all the losers. The Rockets for sure did not expect it to happen with James Harden to happen. Raptors for sure. The Magic. See, the Magic always get overrated every single year. That's what they get. But what's more important, that 186%. Yes, sir. Upvote that one. 690. Six. <laughs> we have come a long way. Me getting hype after a preseason win against the Cavs. Me thinking the Knicks can win the finals. That, that all happened in one season. <laughs> that really all happened in one season. We were so hyped up about how well our preseason was. How much we could surprise the league. But then everyone, and included by stuff, had to keep reminding us that we played the Cavs. We played the Pistons. Let's slow it down. Man, we went out there and we played that well all season long. Shout out to Top Devil, shout out to the Knicks. But this one, this one is hella relatable for sure. In two shortened seasons, let them keep sleeping on broad way barrett dear twitter rj put up these numbers in not one but two shortened seasons dude is an animal keep sleeping on the young man tell him what he say here's the full list of nba players to tally more than 2,000 points 500 rebounds and 300 assists before celebrating their 21st birthday kobe bryant rest in peace kevin garnett tracy mcgrady my guy carmelo anthony my other guy lebron james luka Doncic, kevin durant and rj barrett i'm three for three on this list I'm, I'm just saying, I feel really good. I'm three for three on this list. Tracy McGrady is my all-time favorite basketball player. Carmelo Anthony was next up. And then RJ Barrett. Badman Barrett. Broadway Barrett. This tweet is speaking on deaf, on, on deaf I already knew this. I made several videos trying to let people understand it, but people don't want to understand it. The proof is all in the button. It's right there. That is some company. Start giving that man some respect, bro. Start giving that man some respect. Oh, my gosh. All right. Well... We know the story about the last time I saw some sort of art that I really enjoyed on Reddit, and I tried to get my hands on it, and, well, I failed. But this right here, I don't know what I'm looking at, but it's cool. Had the library print this up for a display. So these are 3D printings of the Knicks. 3D printed, likely going to annoy my wife by putting them everywhere around the house. Alpha Kira, get me one. I want one that stands like the blue one. And then when we move into our new office down the line, not right now, but when we move into our new office and I have my display and everything again, I want this up there. Now I'm only pointing this out because we saw the top five list for the defensive players of the... This man averaged 2.2 blocks per game, 1.1 steal. Only player to average two blocks and one steal this season. But yet, but yet, let me pull up this this trash list of the top defensive players of the season, according to NBA.com. All right, they got Rudy Gobert one, like I mentioned. They got Ben Simmons two, like I mentioned. They got Bam Adebayo three. Click Capella is probably the only person outside of Rudy Gobert on this. And okay, I'll give you Ben Simmons some love and ben, fine. Giannis onto the Kumpo. Right, you want to see the next five? Drew Holiday, Draymond Green, Jimmy Butler, Matisse Thybul, Mikel Bridges. No Nerlens the well to be found. It makes no sense. Absolutely no sense. And even if you don't want to put him in the top five, which he should be in the top five, tell me how he doesn't make this this list right here. Absolutely whack. Get the Blasio off of my screen. All right, I want to play this one. Which Nick is most deserving of an end of the year award? Okay, not most likely, most deserving. Now, I, I've told you guys, I do believe Leon Rose will get executive of the year. It just makes sense. For us to be a fourth seed in the Eastern Conference, have the record that we have, and also have the lowest payroll, without without question. I love D-Rose. D-Rose has been very, very key for us on this team, but I can't give him sixth man of the year. Jordan, Craw Jordan Crawford. What is this, 2009? Jordan Clarkson has been consistent all season. He's a sixth man of the year. Can't give him that. Coach of the year is definitely at the top of my list. But Julius Randle is, is most deserving. Ah, IQ all rookie team. He's going to get that. That's in the bag. Ah, which is most deserving? Most deserving to me has got to be Julius Randle. It's got to be Julius Randle. It's got to be Julius Randle. It, it, I think most deserving for sure. 
I mean, Julius Randle, they should rename the award Most Improved. Like, shout out to Papa Left, because he's right. They should rename the Most Improved Player Award to the Julius Randle Award because he is the definition of Most Improved. The definition. It's one thing when you jump up from points in season to season. No, Julius Randle, percentages, points, minutes, rebounds, steals, assists, field goal, whatever you want. He did everything this year. And not only did he just step up and look like a good player, he stepped up into an all-star in one season. So, yeah, Julius Randle to me hands down playoff ready we here that's actually kind of fire whose merch is this is this somebody's merch is that that's not the nba it's not the knicks is it speaking of merch the all saw that promo go get your merch right now 20 percent off go get yours go get yours before the promotion closes go get it you know what it is p word you know what it is go ahead go get it oh my gosh i'm scared but i'm so curious all right What I'm laughing at is the fact that he put the not safe for work <laughs> tab on it. Oh my gosh. First of all, where the hell is Tim's neck? He looking like Big Ed, bro. I remember this article. January 13th when we were playing solid basketball, but people were still trying to keep on hating on us. They were just waiting for us to decline. It was just supposed to happen, right? We were not supposed to be playing the way we were playing. The schedule was supposed to get tougher, this blah, 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 blah. Check the date. We want an apology or retraction. She put the Knicks may not be good, but don't tell that to Knicks fans. For at least a few games, a young New York Knicks team has given wayward supporters a reason to come along for the ride. But the road to sustained respectability is a bumpy one, no matter which borough it winds through. Bro, it wins through? I guess I get it. Poor Katie had to scrap out the last minute to make her de her deadline. When all else fails, LOL Knicks. She lives to ride another day, and the ringer gets more clicks. Why let facts get in the way of that? Couldn't say better myself than that sharp black. Couldn't say better than myself. Oh my gosh, yeah, and we're, and we're ending on this one. Because this, this I couldn't believe what I was seeing when I saw this. I'm ending on this one for sure. Wonder where you got that from. Well, for those who do not know what I'm talking about, Malik Andrews tweeted this out. Kevin Durant, when asked if he thinks the big three have enough time together on the court this season he responded i think we're the big 15 so yeah oh man the nets just stay stay trying to jack our style don't they y'all in the second seed bro like mind your business why are you why are you looking back at what we doing bro all right y'all that's the end of this installment of nick's reddit video let me know your thoughts on all of the stuff that we went through today i, I missed a lot of things and so on and so forth but we got the playoffs right around the corner like i mentioned at the top of the video the new merch is out right now you can get yourself 20 percent off between now and monday on anything on the site phone cases uh t-shirts sweaters whatever it may be you can get 20% off you have to use the code p word and you guys get yourself 20% off and shout out to my ck crew members if you hit that little join button you get a little some extra all right so become a ck crew member and you might be able to get something better than just 20% off hit that join button anyways y'all you know what it is it's your, your boy ck if you haven't already make sure you subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell. do not forget to like this video guys join the discord make sure you follow me over on twitch i'm out of here y'all see you guys in the next video I'm hoping that the video will be done by tomorrow. I have a next story coming up next. All right, see you guys next one. Let's get it. All love, peace. Feeling like I won the lotto. Always taking trips with a new chick, asking where the time goes. Oh. And I wonder if this is all I'm.